you mob, crack open your favourite fucking Aussie beer. We're about to fucking dive right into the Aussie beer tier list. Hello everybody! Uh, hey, Dr. Nick. <laughs> today, Sam and I are going to review Australian fucking beer. All right, Sam, let's fucking review beer. some. Actually, the first time I ever drank beer, uh, Sam was there. Sam was the man that provided me the beer. 12 years old. No, we weren't 12 years old. Okay, Sam hasn't had as much beer as I have, so he'll provide an interesting perspective. He's going to rate the bottle design or the can design while he drinks his shake. And, and if, I've, if I've tasted it. And if he's tasted it. So, Carlton Draft. So, personally, Carlton Draft, out of a can, Probably like B, probably C tier. All cans for me are, are worse, so they're always going to go down yeah. a tier. My my favorite color is red. Carlton Draft. They have like this unpasteurized beer at some pubs. That would be like A tier. Carlton Dry. I'm not sure what kind this is in a can. Look, I'm just going to go have a try. I don't like it in a can anyway. But Carlton Dry. Now this is the beer of my of my uh, high school. <laughs> of your ancestors. Oh. I give it a. I give it on taste. It's probably like B tier. It's like it, which is good. My scale is B is good. All right, Carlton mid out of can. Same with Carlton Drop. The can or, is red, so. True, tra Plus. true. Oh, Cascade, like, it's like what you uh, get. Yeah. It's like when you go to, like, a funeral and, like, at the bar, they kind of have, like, free beer or something. It's Cascade, like this, the funeral beer. The funeral, <laughs> Cascade, the funeral beer. Probably, like, D. Because, because it's a sad time. It's just, it doesn't bring you good memories. Okay. Oh, Coopers. Coopers. Now, this is a but classic. It's a good beer. It's a good beer. I could even put it A. They got into some drama, maybe like 2016 or something, when they were like, um, the founders were like anti same sex marriage. Bit of a meme that if you drink Coopers, you're homophobic. Oh, right. Yeah. A meme beer. A meme beer. The F tier is not F tier. It's just pure shit. I don't think we've had the session out, so we're gonna have to put that and don't try it. It's barking ale, mate. We know too well. Got the red outlining the Red label. as well. You know what? I, I, I agree. I actually think this is an A tier beer. Not only because it's a great beer, but for how strong it is, it's how many standards, Sammy? Well, I mean, I have I have two. I stand up and uh and you have to sit back down. It's a <laughs> 1.7 standard, as uh, we know all too well. Uh, a tier, fantastic beer, and for the strength, you, you can't tell. Crown. I have had Crown at like they're always at like. Fancy function yeah, or something yeah. like that. A wise man once told me, you remember Sean Garden? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He once told me, he's like, mate, the bloody crown lager, you got your fucking vat. You've got your <laughs> crown lagers where they take it from the top of the vat. Fucking VB, they take it from the middle of the vat. And then your mill and bitter, they take it from the bottom of the I vat. I remember him being an the uh, If you're watching this, Sean Gardner, for you, I want to put the crown for like C tier. Uh, this. Oh, this is another. This is another funeral beer. Always at funeral, like always at functions. Doesn't remind you of good times. Whatever. Oh. Fat yak. Okay. Oh, I have one. had. Yeah. Okay. I love. I love. It. I think it's like B, possibly A tier. I think I bought them when I was like eighteen. Experimental phase. Yeah, I think. I think it's very high. I would. I would be comfortable putting it A personally. It does have a yak on it. it. Does have a yak. Yaks and are yaks cool. are cool. Yaks are so... fucking sick, man. Han super dry. Uh, I'm gonna call it say funeral beer. It's, it's... Are we are we, are we labeling Hans as? <laughs> Han is the funeral beer. All the Hans are the funeral, funeral, beer. <laughs> funeral beers, dude. I'm fucking around Hans. Hans the funeral beer. This these coming up. Are my pure shit tier. I don't know how people drink it. I've never had a good What's one. What's it called? Like, so it's Iron Jack. Iron Jack. That's I like, yeah, look yeah, yeah. Iron Jack. The can would be worse. True Blue Aussie. I don't know what their brewing process is like, but it definitely involves oh, like so fecal like, matter. You actually hate I hate it. I hate everything about it. I don't know who Iron Jack is, but he's a piece of shit, honestly. So James Bog isn't a funeral beer. It's a, like it's more a general like function a crown? beer. Like a crown. It's almost like a crown. Give it the. Just to appease Sean Gardner. <laughs> this ranking can't be based on this guy we vaguely knew from high school. But he's the beer king. He'd probably be upset if we rated Crown above this your classic function beer. I'm oh, excited. I'm excited lashes. that we haven't got an S yet. I'm looking through here. There are, there are some S's. 150 you know, lashes. Phenomenal. But you can't have more than one. You get, it's like one of those beers that if it's love. It's, it's great to enjoy just once, once or twice. But then you don't. You don't want to. So, but time. if you only like it once or twice. You know? True. But for me, my scale B is high. You know, so I want to go B tier. Yeah. Okay. Okay. The gods were angry that one. Look, we'll go A. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fuck. Sorry. All right. Like C tier, yeah. honestly. It's not. Yeah. It's not terrible. No, oh, maybe going through a hard time. Look, for this, they go through a hard time. We'll give them. We'll give them a C. Yeah. Okay. I haven't had this variation of goat. Goat is quite nice. I don't think it's. But it's that. not the goat. It's not the goat, no. And, and that alone probably should take away points. It's gonna go C, C for false advertising. C for false advertising, okay. We've arrived at our first. <laughs> an all rounder. So you've got beer that's exceptional, like foreign beers that would just be S tier. And that Czech beer, 
know, the person it was named after. That would be S tier, stuff like that. But we're not talking about those kinds of things. Pure Australian beef. It's the bloke that you ring him up at 2 a.m. saying you need a lift, he'll give you a lift. <laughs> you need help with your taxes, he'll come over and give you a hand. Computer problems, ring him up, he'll walk you through it. He's a great bloke. He's a great bloke. A great northern Mate. bloke. And you know what? Right up north is where he's going. Bang. Straight to S tier. Oh. Great Northern, it's an S tier beer. And Looking at the, the style of the... Uh, yeah, what are your thoughts on the marlin? Got nothing against marlin. Marlin was just kind of a sports fish. Cans just... The cans oh, are yeah. good. I just can't drink out of a can. It's a great beer. Put it in a can. So I'm putting it in B tier. Pure Blonde. Pure Blonde's good. I have had it once or twice. Pretty good. I'd, I'd, I'd go as far as to say B tier. No, I'm not going to fuck around too much here, much. I don't know wood. Fucking wood. I, I think I've had that I couldn't tell you one man who's had that beer. The point is, if I can't remember it, it doesn't stand out. That in itself means exactly. it, it can't be anything above C. Wasn't noteworthy, wasn't unnoteworthy. Probably just a staple, good, solid beer. Not, it's not a funeral beer. It's not part of these function beers. I'm having second guesses about these Carlton's being used. But they're red. And red. Okay, so they're red. Color. Okay, fair enough. Ted, uh... Uh... uh Leanne's Insurance. Ted's oh. a good bloke. Ted's a cool name, but... I reckon D tier. It seems like it's a function, it's a funeral beer. Who can be angry at Ted? It's a funeral beer. Two is new in a can. Can immediately knocks off a couple of points. Two I have new. had two, two is new. new. Who hasn't? I mean, it's nothing amazing. It's definitely not horrible. Not a funeral beer. Yeah, if, it's, if it's not a so, funeral yeah. beer and it's not of significant notes, then it has to be safe. It's got a deer on the front. <laughs> this is a controversial one. Two is old. Two is old. I personally I like, it. because I like Guinness. Not in Australia, but like when you're in the UK and you get a, a bloody like, pint of Guinness. Well, I mean, like, what's better? A bloody like, pint of Guinness. The New Testament or the Old Testament? True. And I say, mate, the fucking Old Testament when he was fucking the, striking the, down the, dogs for fucking looking the wrong way, mate. Fucking nest here. When it comes to dark, it's not the best. C tier. Is that? This is this is an important one. This is an important one. Some may say like, the quintessential Australian beer. Yeah, VB. Is it a good beer? Yeah. I don't hate it. But when you drink VB, it's it's the beer that makes you feel. It's one of the beers that makes you feel the most Australian. And okay. that alone gives you a, a feeling inside that you just surpasses simply a taste. I mean, you watch any sport in Australia. Yeah. What's the sponsor? It's just... I've got to go... Oh, look, it's at least B. I think A. It could Honestly, be A. I think a. It could be A. Are we really putting VB with pure blonde? That's a fair point. It's done enough for us to observe A. It's a good beer, mate. And you know what? It's stubby. Yeah, okay, well, it's A. Wild Jack is... Fantastic. I really like Wild Jack. Yeah, Not even gonna fuck around with this one. Yeah. I honestly this love it so you. much. You. Straight to A. I'll have to try it. Uh, this one's this one's underrated. This one I would have thought I'd hate it. I actually really like it. Summer. It's a 4X summer. Yeah, it's good. It's actually a nice beer. It's a light, refreshing beer. Exceeded expectations. It is great in summer. Mate, straight to B tier, I reckon. 4X. The What's bitter, the, bitter I'm not a fan of. Red can though. Red can, okay. You like the red? Yeah. I reckon C tier at least. Yeah, just because the other red cans. 4X is probably the only tinny I'll get around. Other than maybe Great Northern. So I'd say it goes in B tier. Right at the end. May I just add this little tip? Yeah. 4X my father's favourite beer. So I oh. have like, oh, it's just got black. that memory oh. of just having a beer with my dad. Oh, that's beautiful. Right. And we've arrived at the last beer, which takes the second S tier spot, Furphy. Oh my god. What an exceptional beer. For, for many it. different different reasons to the Great Northern as well. Where the Great Northern is the bloke that comes over and helps. Furphy is the bloke from school that was always lovely, yeah. always a good kid, yeah. and then turns out to become like a very successful mm. they he start let, business. He let you copy your homework. He, let, he didn't complain. You know, he just wanted the best for you. But you know, he did his own thing, good on him. Did well, did with himself, and now and now he's running for say, Prime Minister. Say, look, I've forgotten to do my homework. Oh, he'd step in. Yeah, just... No, fuck, no doubt. Here you go. Furphy, S tier. Phenomenal beer, phenomenal so taste. So, S tiers are... S tiers are Great Northern, just like the, the full strength one, and Furphy. Phenomenal. It wasn't easy ranking all these beers. And we'll, we'll have to come back and try the... Haven't tried? Try yeah, 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 yeah. A part two. I have a feeling they're all trash. But that's right. Well, let's just let's just put Han into the funeral bin. Oh, I didn't even flex the, the fucking. Han's the funeral bin. Yeah, okay. Look, we'll just fill this out of here. Han funeral bin. And now it's looking beautiful. Well, that's phenomenal. Yeah. Well, thank you, ladies and gentlemen. This has been Play, Sam. Been I didn't pleasure. even introduce you. That's all right. I'm the uh, beer king. Sam the beer king. Sam the beer king. I was I was wearing this the whole time as well. Even though oh, at the no. start of the video I said I don't drink that much beer. Nah, you're the beer king. I'm the beer protege.